Hi there. If you're looking for ways to stop or reduce self-harming long-term, at spunout.ie, we've put together some practical advice. One way to start is by introducing some other ways to cope. Some helpful coping mechanisms can be support groups, seeing a counsellor, getting active, or keeping a journal of your emotions. Focus on things that help your body feel good, like eating nutritious food, getting exercise to boost your mood, and getting good sleep. Talk to a doctor if you find these difficult. Sharing what's going on for you can be a bit scary, but it's often a big relief. You don't have to know or understand why you do it or what started it either. That's part of what someone can help you figure out. There are days when you might self-harm and other times you might be able to try different coping mechanisms. This is all part of the process. Any progress, however small, means you are further along the path of recovery. Lastly, speak to a therapist, counsellor or psychologist. Your GP can arrange a referral for you. You can also find lots more information and support at spunout.ie forward slash self-harm.